Hey guys, so today I yet have another tutorial for you guys, and I'm actually still trying to get out the products. Um, yeah. But I really like this because it's a really cheap way to go, and, um, I don't know, it's just a good look to do for really cheap. Um... So, yeah, I'm still trying to get my products together. So this is kind of like a gold, PG bronze look. And I'm actually sitting in a different chair today. And my actually other chair is over here. It's just the pillow isn't on it because my brother is using the pillow for his, um, like, fort that he's doing with his friend. So, yeah, I don't have my pillow, and I just thought I would sit in this chair. I don't know. I forgot how much I like this chair. So, yeah, and I'm actually wearing a long sleeve shirt in the middle of summer, and I don't know why I am. I just am. <sighs> yeah. So, we can almost go ahead and get started okay so that was really weird but the first thing that I'm going to do is take my Laura Mercier eye basics in the color linen and this is actually like the lightest color and it's supposed to be a concealer and an eye primer I only use it for the eye primer just because I like to have light eye primers so I don't know why this is. What did I just drop? Okay, this lighting is kind of harsh here because I actually opened the blinds too much today. So, yeah, we're just going to do three dots and three dots there. And then we are going to blend it out. Okay, I don't want this light. <laughs> So we're just going to blend it out like on your lid and up to your crease basically. So, yeah. Then I'm going to take this e.l.f. all over color stick that you can get at Target for only a dollar. So I thought that was so good. And this is in the color golden peach and this is what it looks like and I'm just gonna take a little bit on my finger or a lot <laughs> and just apply it to my lid to make that to make the lid a little more gold peachy color and the all over color stick even smells like peaches I thought was a great benefit because I love the smell of peaches. Okay. I know this is really bad lighting. It was better lighting when um, I didn't even have the blinds open. I'll be right back. I have to climb up a ladder to close my stupid blinds. Okay. I think that's the same thing. But yeah, so this is what it looks like now. And then I'm going to take my crease brush. And this is my favorite one. And this is from Sephora. And I'm just going to take it on my crease and windshield wiper motions I know I'm acting really weird today but so yeah that's what it looks like and then I'm not going to do any eyeliner but I'm going to apply a mascara 
And this is the CoverGirl Professional Mascara. This is actually a new bottle to me, and um, I like it. I mean, I've never tried it before. So yeah, that is that, and then I am going, okay, so now for face, I'm going to be applying my Neutrogena powder with a Kabuki brush. This eye look looks very nice in person. It's very pretty, um... Oh, I didn't mention that this eyeshadow, the one that I use on my crease, is from Ulta, and this is the color Suede, Sade, I think, I don't know, so, yeah, um, and then after, I'm just going to take my e.l.f. contouring blush and bronzer, and I'm going to take a complexion brush, and I'm just going to dip that into the bronzer side, and then two by bronzer. And then I'm going to take a blush brush and I am going to dip that into a Tarte Amazonian Clay 12 hour blush in Doll Face. And this is a really pretty pink color. I don't know if you can see it like that and then I'm just going to apply it to my cheeks okay this is bad lighting I don't like this at all at all at all okay sorry about that and then blush and then that is it for face and we cannot forget about the lips which I forgot about which is very embarrassing, but for lips, I'm going to be applying my Bobbi Brown Lip Gloss in the color Pink Blossom, and this is a very nice pink color. Like that. So this is the finished look. Um, I really do like the eyes. Um, yeah, so it's just a very nice look, a cheap way to go um, with the eyeshadows. This is only $2, and this is $1, so I think that was great. And this, Laura Mercier, I think you don't have to have it, but you should have, like, a... Uh, like a stay on like not that blendable eye primer but like a lighter color like this one and it's showing up like white on my camera but it's not it's like it's like a peak toned color I think no Okay, none of these colors are accurate for this, but if you ever get the chance to go to Sephora or, like, Nordstrom's or something like this, always check this out. So, yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video, and I'll see you guys soon. Bye.